So, Bill, do you know Ann Winkler, or do you do you know who she was, or? Yeah, I worked at grade school with her. You did. Yes. And uh, you know, she recently passed last year in January, yeah. almost a year ago now. Yeah. yeah. So you know the whole Winkler family. Tell me more about that. No, I don't. Just just her. Just her. Yeah. And her our adopted son. Yeah, and, and she had a house at five nineteen. Uh, uh, East Main, I and she got a loan from U.S. Bank. It was a reverse mortgage, but the note said uh, fifty thousand on it, and somebody scratched it out and put fifty-two thousand. It was notarized by Peggy, the branch manager there, the same place where you were having trouble. And the money apparently went to McKay Hospital. Tell me about your experiences at McKay Hospital. No? <laughs> you don't want to talk about it. Okay. So what's what's your beef with the mayor of Salt Lake? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing now? <laughs> okay. The only thing, oh, well, okay. Okay. he tells me that uh, he cannot ask the police department to go uh, up under... The surface of the ground to arrest anybody. And why would you want them to go under your house to look for what? Because somebody authorized someone, which I don't know who it is, to dig holes underneath my mobile home. Okay, and what are they doing? Hanging out under there or sneaking in there? What is, what's going on? Well, I know one thing they're doing. They, they they did it to uh, prevent me from taking the mobile home off of the property. Oh. Why so would you... So if you try to move the, move the mobile home, the wheels will drop into these holes, oh. and there you're set. Oh, I see. So you can't move this home? No. Basically. No. Not because of that. Oh. So what's, I so what's that got to do with the mayor, Gravel, the realtor guy? Uh, well, when 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 uh, I discovered somebody was uh, digging holes underneath, I tried to get a hold of someone to get it stopped because I didn't give them permission. Huh. Uh, I had a power of attorney which I had to have at one time because I was headed to the hospital and I had nobody here that I felt comfortable with to do my work for, pay my bills and this and that while I'm in the hospital. So I appointed this fellow that I've known for years. We share coffee with him. Uh, uh, Tiger Paws, the trader. Uh, I knew him quite well, so I appointed him as part of the son. Then, after having been a part of the son for a while, I found out he did, wasn't doing the right thing. Mm. So he did it several times with me because I was in in the hospital, out of the hospital, back in the hospital, in the in the uh, physical uh, therapy places, you know, uh, this and that. So I left him as part of the attorney. Well, he authorized somebody to come and dig holes into my place. Mm. See, I know somebody that wants this property, but they want it for free. Mm. Okay, I got the picture. 